Thank you. With the glory of being nominated, it's important to note that there was a time in the making of each of these movies when all those surrounding the director thought that he was doing it absolutely wrong. It is the nature of directing to be second-guessed. It's the nature of the director to wonder if anyone will care about the things that he has cared about for so long. We do care, and tonight's nominations are the clear signal that we could send to you. I almost opened that thing. The nominees are John Singleton for Boys in the Hood, Barry Levinson for Bugsy, Oliver Stone for JFK, Jonathan Demme for Silence of the Lambs, Ridley Scott for Thelma and Louise, And the Oscar goes to, to Jonathan Demme for Silence of the Lambs. In the, uh, in the context of my uh, uh, movie-loving life, uh, uh, I, I, this is very unanticipated. Um, uh, it's uh, the only way I can really um, uh, understand this is to, to recognize that I had the, uh, uh, the, the great good fortune to uh, have a chance to work with Ted Talley's um, great adaptation of Thomas Harris's uh, uh, extraordinarily moral and an amazing book, uh, and to, to have the um, uh, the good fortune to uh, work with the, the likes of Tak Fujimoto and Christy Zia, Craig McKay and Tommy Fleischman and Chris Newman and Howard Shore and Howard Feuer and Billy Miller and and everybody. I, I've, I'm, <sighs> and uh, the the uh, the uh, and and also to uh, to be able to to um, to, to work with such an ensemble cast of actors uh, that with Jody and Tony, of course, and, and also um, uh, Ted Levine for his exceptionally courageous uh, performance as James Gum and Scott Glenn and Anthony Heald and, and Brooke Smith and, and Diane Baker and, and all the other wonderful actors. Um, I also, uh, that won't take forever, uh, sorry. Uh, I also had uh, the, the extraordinary good fortune to uh, have, uh, have uh, um, been embraced by by Orion Pictures uh, at a time which, which uh, un unlike this this amazing peak moment of my life, uh, I was at a kind of a low uh, valley moment when uh, when uh, the uh, Mike Metavoy and Bill Bernstein and and Arthur Krim and Eric Pleskow uh, kind of reached out to me and encouraged me and and uh, and and helped create a home for for uh, for my collaborators and myself, and uh, we made some movies for them and and uh, and and. When, uh, I'll never forget when Mike Metavoy said, I think there's a book you might be interested in. Uh, I'll send it over. And uh, it's, it's obviously, I know everybody feels the, the um, extraordinary irony of, of, uh, of uh, what's, what's happened, this terrible thing that's happened to Orion uh, at, at a moment of, of, of reemergence that included Silence of the Lambs and many other things. And uh, uh, I, I, one thing, uh, uh, anyway, uh, two other quick things. I'm sorry, this is, t this is almost... One, just about directing, um, I wanted very much to salute uh, John Singleton and Maddie Rich and Jody Foster and, and uh, Ernest Dickerson and uh, a, a bunch of new people in the last year that have come on with, with very exciting, wonderful visions and really breathed a, a tremendously important new life into, into our whole uh, cinematic uh, 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 landscape. Uh, and uh, I, th I really want to salute those people uh, very strongly. Um, I, I also uh, want to uh, very, very quickly, um, I, I had the good fortune of, of, uh, of, uh, of being uh, uh, encouraged and, and, uh, and uh, briefed by two um, great uh, American filmmakers um, who, who uh, are no longer with us. And I very much, I'm, I'm thrilled to be able to, uh, to invoke uh, the, the recent memory of, of two great men, two great filmmakers, um, Hal Ashby and Martin Ritt, who were really, really wonderful to me. And uh, uh, finally, um, 
And uh, I've, I've obviously got to say, hi, Mom, you, um, and, and thanks for, for transferring your love of movies to me, and, and thanks, Dad, for making me think I could actually be part of this industry. And uh, um, thank you. Thank you.